Death toll in China has now surpassed 600 as health officials there continue to try and stop the spread of the coronavirus. Here in Philadelphia, public officials are trying to combat a very different kind of spread. Alexandria Hoff joins us with more. Ale well, Jessica, officials locally are working to halt rumors and unfair stereotyping as it relates to the coronavirus. Earlier this week, we heard from business owners in Chinatown who say they are struggling. And today, the mayor stepped in. Mayor Jim Kenney enjoyed a Thursday meal of dim sum at Ocean Harbor Restaurant in Philadelphia's Chinatown. A gesture of support for a community where some business owners feel that fear over the coronavirus has kept customers away. We're trying to get the word out through the media that Chinatown is safe, the city's safe, the state's safe, the country's safe. Everybody should relax and we have enough strong public health services to make sure that nothing gets out of control. Nationwide, the number of confirmed cases stands at 12. It has not reached the Philadelphia area. The coronavirus is not spreading in Philadelphia right now. You know, there is a global public health risk, but we're not seeing it in Philadelphia now. Meanwhile, China has suffered its deadliest day so far in the outbreak. In the past 24 hours, 70 more people have died, including Dr. Li Wenliang, a Chinese doctor who first voiced concerns over the virus and was reprimanded by the government for doing so. In the epicenter of the outbreak, the Hubei province in China, as many as 1,000 Americans have been ordered to evacuate. It's safest for these Americans who are healthy and not known to be infected to be brought home. Some American evacuees have already landed in California. More will be brought back to the U.S. through Texas and Nebraska, where they will be under temporary quarantine as they are tested for the coronavirus. Again, there are no confirmed cases of coronavirus in Philadelphia or the surrounding areas. Still, the Philadelphia Department of Health did announce new prevention protocols, including monitoring the health of residents returning to Philly from China. Those who do so will need to remain in their homes for up to 14 days to account for testing. Reporting live in the SAT Center, I'm Alexandria Hoff, CBS3 Eyewitness News. All right, Alex, thank you.